We play and call it work. Hey everybody, Matthew here from miniboardgaming.com and welcome to a painting partner program video. This is where we make uh, advertising for people who do painting for us. This one is for Black Anvil Studio. You can see the links in the description below to his Facebook and his Instagram. And his commission that he decided to do for us was a bunch of random Imperial Guard stuff. Basically there was a lot of the Imperial agents that I wanted to add in and then there was also like Ogrins and Bulgrins and Commissars that I needed done. So they're all on a list and he basically took all the miscellaneous stuff and got it done which is awesome because now I have them when I need them. So I'm just going to go left to right to show you the stuff that he has done for us. To start off we got our Bulgrins and our Ogrins. And so, which he just does a fantastic job on, especially when you consider that I just asked for basically our battle report quality, which needs to look good on camera, which they do. So we got these awesome Ogrins with their Ripper guns and the Bulgrins with their slab shields and grenadier gauntlets. And then we've even got the name character. I think his name is... Oh, uh, ah, I can't remember it off the top of my head. Neck or Nurk or something like that. And so he's a named character, one that you can bring with the Imperial Guard. And a couple more Bulgarians, another Ogren up here. Fantastically done. And if you're wondering about all the terrain it's set up for our Armageddon campaign that we're doing, and you're going to see some of these Bulgarians and Ogrens used in the Armageddon campaign, because Josh is playing a Grot slash Ogren faction, a Grot revolution, where they've convinced a bunch of Ogrens to join them. So he'll be using some of these models for that campaign. And then as we continue, we've got some Primaris Psychers. I just needed them done, just so I have access to them when I want to do the certain formations, or just have the Imperial Agents. Got a couple of Astropaths, so that I have a few more of them. And then we got our Masters of Ordnance, I think they are. Yeah, Masters of Ordnance. So they can call down those extra bombardments. They're usually part of company command squads, but in Imperial Guard, but with Imperial Agents, you can now bring them on their own. If you want to, they help your reserves, and they allow you to bring in some more orbital bombardments. We've got a couple Officers of the Fleet, once again, normally part of a company command squad, but the Imperial Agents book allows you to bring them individually with Valkyries. Of course, 8th edition's coming out, so who knows how they'll be used there, but at least we'll have all the models handy. We got our Katachan. It's a Strachan, I believe is his name. Iron Hand Strachan or Iron Fist Strachan. But uh, I just wanted him so that when I wanted to try him out, I could. Got a bunch of Commissars, because we only have like two or three, which is enough, but it's nice to have the different weapon options. So we have some just with close combat weapon pistol. We got a plasma pistol. We got one with the awesome book and power fist. So and it's just very well done. I'm very happy with all these. And lastly, down here, we have a bunch of Servitors, heavy bolter and plasma cannon Servitors. So I just kind of flesh out those squads as well. So there's four of each of them. Overall, I'm very, very, very happy with this job. Got it done in a somewhat timely manner, and the price was good, and so I definitely do recommend them. So go check it out. There's links below. If you are interested in him doing work for you, then go just go to any of those and contact him. Even if you're not interested in having him do work for you, we always encourage you to go and like their Facebook page and Instagram page. One, just to thank them for doing this work but also because I personally like to follow lots of Facebook pages that show awesomely painted miniatures because I find it inspiring for ideas. Not that I paint my own miniatures because I don't like doing it, but it still inspires me for the like campaigns and battle reports that we decide to do. I'll show you some pictures of other work that he's done as well, but links are in the description below. Thank you so much for this work, Black Anvil Studio, and to everybody else, happy working.